Like I said. Mm, this is pretty good. Well, there's no more of those in the closet. There's some more noodles in the closet. Good morning, guys. Just having some eggs for breakfast. And with that, everything bagel from Trader Joe's, which is actually really good. I really like it. It has a lot of flavor. Like a garlicky flavor, which is my kind of flavor. My husband's making him some noodles for breakfast. Put your head in there. You like it? Up, guys, this is good. This from Trader Joe's. Yeah, that everything but the bagel seasoning. Oh, yeah, good seasoning. Yeah. Mmm. So good. Look, y'all. My husband's actually cooking his own meal, and he actually used the pot on the stove. And now he's dumping all the water out. Babe, don't put too much water out. You're not gonna like it like that. <laughs> Let's see what he does. Spinners. Yeah, I didn't even know you knew how to turn the stove on. Really? Yeah. Damn. <laughs> uh huh. So I see you know how to feed yourself. Yep. Noodles. <laughs> Evidence. He also knows how to use a knife. <laughs> mm, yeah. yeah, but actually, you know, when you use a knife to cut fruit, you be cutting all wrong. You cut it American style. American style? I'm not American. Not Cambodian style. Because Cambodian people use a knife opposite of other people. Yes. Your noodles actually look really good, honey. You want some? Maybe a bite. I'll taste your cooking. I'm going to taste his noodles. Oh. Why, honey? What kind of noodles did you make? The mama? Yeah. No. Yeah, mama. Beef. Oh. What? What are you looking for? Garlic salt. It's right there. Garlic powder. Oh, garlic salt is right there behind the marin. I mean the um, rice vinegar. Why do you need garlic salt? It's not salty? Okay guys, so I'm so eating guys, things off. Here's my noodles. Let's make all by yourself. <laughs> Except for the eggs. I haven't cooked in a long time. What did you use to cook? Chicken? Noodles. Chicken. Baked chicken. You used to blot it and cook it? No. How'd you cook it? Just bake it. Throw it in. Did you put Salsa. seasoning? No. Is it good? It's sad. That's more flavor, honey. Is it overcooked? No. He upgraded it with some lettuce, bean sprouts, basil, and some golden mountain sauce. Is it better? Oh, yeah. Really good now? Yeah, I have lettuce. Do you guys eat cooked lettuce? Cause I do not know how to eat that. He uh, he likes it in his cathedral and um like stuff like that. I don't know how to eat that. I don't. I didn't grow up eating it like that. Did you, babe? Yeah. I feel like people from the south south side of Atlanta grew up eating it like that. But I don't know how to eat it like that at all. 
Super yummy. Still missing something? Meat. Oh. <laughs> it's already like 4.30. I just been sitting on the couch all day long watching, um, what do you call that show? It's Umbrella Academy. But anyways, I'm prepping dinner. I'm making that curry, the chicken I marinated in the last video, which was yesterday. And then um, I was supposed to make that chapati thing I told you guys about, but I've been stuck watching that show, so and I don't feel like making it. So we're just gonna have it with uh, some naan that we got at the store. So I'm about to make this curry and show you guys how it turns out. I hope it turns out well. But anyways, I'm gonna parboil my veggies or the potatoes and the collie. And then I am about to start on the gravy. Which is gonna be tomato sauce, or I have crushed a can of crushed tomatoes, and then I'm gonna put the rest of that coconut milk I have in there, and then I have some sour cream. So I don't know how that would taste in there, but I might not, I might not put that in if it's not needed. So I'm about to get started on this gravy. Hey guys, right, got the curry going here. Um, so I have the crushed tomatoes. Look, it's a full side in my spider. Uh, chicken, the parboiled cauliflower potatoes. So I'm letting this go. I add some extra garam masala and some uh, ground coriander and some curry powder. So I'm letting this and some salt. Letting this get cooked and, and then I will add it. the coconut milk in. Coconut the chicken milk. looks weird because it's all like shredded. I don't know why. Okay. This is how it looks. So I'm heating up the naan in the air fryer and then we'll do a little taste test. Here's our food plated. I just have one naan that I just heated up. This is a roasted garlic that we'll heat up more as we go. So go ahead, babe. Hungry. Smells like uh, chicken tikka masala, huh? Yeah. Kind of. Tastes like Indian curry. Mm. Yeah, not bad. That's good. Taste it with this naan. I got like a tomato. Just tomato sauce. Hot. Yes, yeah, fresh. It's a little sour. Should add more sugar to it. Yeah, a little too. Yeah. Mmm. Uh -huh. Oh. Oh, I might get that. Let's just use always going out in this house. Alright, it's a little sour, in my opinion. I could probably add some more sugar to it. I did add some sugar already, but it does taste like a. It tastes like Trader Joe's frozen Indian food. The butter chicken one. You know what I'm talking about, honey? The Trader Joe's butter chicken? Oh, yeah. That's good. That's what it tastes like. Yeah, it does. This will be good with some rice. Basmati rice, but we don't have that. I'm about to try this that Daniel bought because they didn't have regular fruit by the foot. So we're trying to start us one. And this is cherry. Cherry flavor. Oh, that's a really potent cherry smell. Oh my gosh, not. Ooh. Man, I used to love me some fruit by the foot. Bring back old memories. Those are the best. Ten by year the old. Foot. And gushers and stuff are the best. Nostalgia. It tastes like Starburst. Huh? It tastes like Starburst? Mm hmm. It's good. It tastes like cherry Starburst. I'm not a huge cherry flavor person. Are you? I'm not really. I hate cherry flavor stuff. Like, so it tastes like medicine? Yeah. 
Yeah. Don't mind you up last time, man. Hmm? Not bad. It's good. It's all right. They have strawberry, orange, and lemon. He said these were all sold out at Walmart. He had to go to Kroger. And he also got... Thank you. You want some like berry flavor stuff. Some mulches, berries. And... I've already packed Gushers. Which, this only has six packs. What you gonna do with six packs? Let's say nothing. Yep. That's too little. Anyways, honey, what did you think about the dinner? The dinner was good. I liked it. He really liked it. Two up two bowls. I think it would be a lot better with rice. Yeah, it would. Mix it up. Uh huh. Mm, it would have been so good with some rice. Yeah. I was yeah. gonna buy some basmati rice yesterday. Did that? Mm hmm. But. We purchased basmati rice like a few times and I just never know how to cook the rice properly. So that might be something I need to learn how to do is how to make some basmati rice because I love basmati rice. It's long grain. You seen that fruit by the foot challenge yet? No. You wanna do it? No. That's too much to eat. How much you gotta eat? You roll the whole thing and you eat it. And you can't touch it or something. Good. And you see who eats it the fastest. Oh, you should do that. I can't do that. You're gonna win. How are you finished, Russ? So Dan's gonna have curry for the next three days. Um, this week on the menu we have I'm gonna do like a plea psycho, but I'm gonna make it into a steak and not raw not raw um psycho. So I'm gonna steak it, then I'm gonna mix it with the balai and the sauce and stuff like that. Um, what else do we have to make? Hmm. Oh, I'm gonna do some spring rolls because I've been meaning to make that for a couple weeks. What else? Let me see. I was have on my reminder app on apple or on uh, iphone things that i want to make and i have grocery lists and stuff like that so we keep a running list of stuff like that so i'm gonna make play psycho spring rolls maybe red curry i don't know i don't really like red salagari daniel loves salagari uh, i'm gonna do some pork ribs probably and yeah that's pretty much it mm. i don't know so I just sit there think my food and I add it to this list. But yeah. Anything you wanna add? No. Did you have a good time at the gym? Yeah. That was good. How long? Felt weak. How long were you here for? About uh, forty minutes. What kind of precautions are they taking? Uh tell the camera. Uh yeah. You went to the gym today, so what kind of things are you they doing different? When you check in, they take your check your temperature. But the girl at the front desk today, she took a temperature at your chest. Never seen that before. She pointed at your chest. Maybe she was aiming for her armpit. No, I don't know. So what else? That's well, it? she was short. Man, that's it. And give you a bottle of sanitizer to take. Was there a lot of people? Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little bit. Did you wear a mask? Yes. The whole time? Mm -hmm. Wore my neck gator. Were there a lot of people wearing masks? No. Half. Uh, 75% wasn't wearing masks. Is a swimming pool open? Mm, I don't think so. I want to go swimming. It was water in there, but I don't see nobody in there. Oh. All right. Um, we have no plans for tonight. Probably just sit on the couch while we always do. Anyway, so I'm trying intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting. Intermittent. So right now, my eating schedule is from ten to six. So I'm doing a sixteen eight. So sixteen hours fasting, eight hours eating. You wanna try that with me? No, you can't do it. You probably won't be able to do it. I'll pass out. I need to. So as the only time I really get hungry during the day is in the morning. I normally get hungry around like eight or nine. So, excuse me. As long as I can hold off until 10 o'clock, then I'm eat at 10 and then probably like one and then like 5.30. And then do that and hopefully can lose some weight doing that. But anyways, we're gonna call it a night here. 
So we'll see y'all in the next one. Peace. Bye, guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.